So I'm making my way to the movie theater Young and Dundas to watch Bad Moms. Uh, hopefully we get it because it's at 1.55 and it's currently like 1.30. Hopefully we make it. definitely not gonna make it to the movie showing at 155 because it is like two o'clock right now we're gonna have to kill off like two more hours this is gonna be fucking hell yeah right so we didn't make it it's dead on two o'clock right now the movie started at 155 I don't want to miss like 50 minutes of it so we are gonna have to kill off like two hours and catch the movie at like four o'clock 4 30 be like really shitty but we'll figure out something. Probably go Pokemon hunting. On this episode of pretending to shop at places that we know we can't afford, this episode is True Religion. Holy shit, 400 fucking dollars for a pair of jeans? What the hell? I think my wallet threw off. Yeah. <laughs> I can afford those because I make like a million dollars on YouTube, you know. YouTube money? Yeah, obviously. That's like more expensive than freaking Apple, like goddamn. $400, what can you get? You could get freaking... Look, there's Apple. You can get an iPhone, an SE. You can get like 50 games. You can get like an... You can get a PS4 for $450. Alright, since we have like two hours, two hours to kill before the movie, we're going to get free pizza, courtesy of this guy. Thank you. Oh, bless. I love pizza. It's going to be so blessed. Look at this sketchy ass bathroom, dude. Oh my god. It's actually like the most, it's like my height. I have to like duck under the freaking, I have to like duck under the freaking, look at the size of these doors. Yo, it's like my height. Yo, this is like terrifying. Oh, it's so sketchy. Yo! Nice ass. You guys see, you have piping, your electrical, got this nice clean ass mirror, got your sexy ass toilet with some mystery liquid in there. Oh, that's so nice. I think I need to like heavily disinfect my hands after touching those. I feel like I had contracted like Ebola or something from that. Yo, those washrooms are actually so freaking sketchy. Yo, that yeah, mystery, that bit little mystery liquid in the bottom, the, the shit that stays there, oh, it's so fucking weird. They Yo. didn't allow the guy though. They didn't allow yeah, him. Yeah, there was this homeless dude, probably, maybe homeless dude, that they didn't allow him to use the bathroom. It was like, why? Like, come on. We were going to buy our tickets and then walk around even more because it's still not time. <laughs> You guys should expect a full review of Bad Moms once I come out of the theater. Alright, we are gonna go to the nearest Dollarama to low-key sneak some snacks into the movie theater because no one wants to pay freaking $20 for a small bag of popcorn. That's just BS. If you don't live in Canada, Dollarama is your dollar store. It is better than anything ever. Oh yeah, Dollar, dollar Trees. Dollar Tree sucks compared to Dollar. Dollarama has like Maynard's freaking large ass bottles of Pepsi for like 79 cents. I don't know if you guys remember, but last vlog, this happened. This might be flagged, but naked bike ride? Okay. Uh, hopefully nothing shows because I don't want this to be flagged. Yeah, it happened. It happened just out there. I saw so many old, old people dick that day. It was... <laughs> Get Ross to the vet, so I love you kids. Get out, get out. Oh my god! The weirdest shit happened when we were watching that movie. They were the people in the freaking corner, like doing like the freaking the, the nasty, nasty inside the corner. They did like, what the <laughs> what the hell? You don't do that, dude. That's public. Do it at home. 
All right, so quick review on the movie I just saw. It was actually really funny. A lot of the jokes were like mom jokes. So really, I'm a guy, so I wouldn't understand, I guess. Is that the right word? Yeah. And it stayed funny throughout the entire movie. There was a lot of like jokes that were like very inappropriate. There was even one scene where it's just like full-fledged tits and ass, like, you know. And it was 14 plus. I know at some theaters that like most theaters is like R-rated, so I don't know why at this theater it was like 14 months. I don't get it. But it was a good movie, all in all. Very good. Yeah, no, I'll tell you a little bit more about what the hell happened in that movie theater in the corner. But these two couples, one of them had like pink hair, the other one had like long brown hair. Uh, all we heard was like these, this loud ass squeaking in the corner. And um, he was like, Brandon, they're doing it in the corner. I was like, I didn't believe him because so I'd be like, why? It's a public place, save it for home. But when the movie ended, when everyone was getting up, uh, all I saw was the guy pull his pants up and he had like, the, like, he had... What'd you get, dude? I got boner. Oh, cool. <laughs> but the thought of doing that in like a public movie, it was, why? Why? Yo, this is actually badass. I'll let you guys read this. Dude, these people are so smart. They sell drinks. They smell. They, yeah, they sell freaking chairs. Everything. We, dude, we switched spots because the last spot was like really hot because there's so many people there. This one's like nice and breezy because the water's like over there. It's actually really nice. And I also like people watching. So this is like the perfect spot. The boardwalk. I'm a, yeah, I'm a creep. <laughs> also, that's the pirate ship from last vlog. I don't know if you remember it, but I took like a timeline. It's actually really cool. I want to go on it. I don't know how much tickets are. Also, I'm like really poor at the moment, so I can't really go on there. Yo, this guy's worse than me at freaking Pokemon. This guy's just dragging me to Japan Jatini. We're inside now. Where is this Jatini dragging us? I think they're trying to find it too. But look at that, it's so cool. This is so cool. The water, the bill, freaking building, the boat. That, it looks so cool. I can use this as like a back. That'd be pretty dope. Yo, look, the pirate ship's moving. That's actually pretty. That's just, that's so cool. I played a lot of Assassin's Creed Black Flag and I've always liked sailboats. So that, that is so cool. Bye, beautiful. Harbor front water. Bye. Bro, I think that street card stuck. I don't even know what happened. They like derailed. What the? So we're like stuck. What is going on? The power's out. Everyone just got like pushed out of the freaking. So what do we? I don't even know what we do. Like, did we pay two dollars for nothing? Yeah, yes, yeah, we did. Uh, I think we have to walk. <laughs> All the streetcars are like dead. They're like gone. There's the two over there. We have to walk all the way to Spadina Station. This is just gonna be the death of me. It's not even that far. I'm, I'm, pff, it's not far. What do you mean? <laughs> Never mind. Streetcar came in clutch. Oh, thank God. The clutch streetcar. Thank you. 